Hey everybody, Nate Hyatt here, creator of Conscience and Nonsense. How's it going out there? Say hi, Steve. Hey everybody, what's happening? Uh, how's life treating you? Conscience? Hello, yes, it's it's the phony British professor. Not real, just a big old floating head with wings and a multiple glasses floating around saying British things. Mm-hmm, yes, everyone's buying into it completely, not sure. Not sure if you got the idea from Alan Watts or whatever. And nonsense. Hey, how you doing? It's your buddy nonsense. Hey, you know, people often ask me, you know, where you from, nonsense? And it's like, yeah, well, you know, I grew up partly in Boston and partly in Brooklyn. So that's kind of why I got a little bit of a weird accent. Some people think I'm a Bugs Bunny ripoff, but, uh, you know, that's their problem, really. So, uh, Steve is, uh, he's in the comic strip. Just to keep you up to date, if you haven't been following the comic strip, I, I, I think I can tell what's going on with me better than uh, better than you can. Nate. Um, not no disrespect, Mr. Cartoonist, creator, artist, person, but uh, yeah, I, I got this. Okay, well, go ahead, go right on, Steve. Yeah, well, anyway, um, I'm, I'm okay. So, like. I went to the first psych ward, and uh, they were all, well, you know, that's water under the bridge. They weren't cool. I got the woman handled by this female security guard, and things got a little weird and almost kind of kinky in a way. That was kind of odd, but that's water under the bridge. I got out of there, got back with uh, Pastor Brown, Billy Bob Candy, and uh, met up with my friend uh, Lester again, new friend Lester. And uh, the money went through from the lawsuit that my uncle had. Uh, you know, he passed away. And uh, now, well, uh, I'm a millionaire. Only um, Pastor Brown, my parents went to him because apparently uh, I'm still... Uh, Apparently, I'm still uh, kind of regarded by the state as, like, mentally different. That's what I am. I'm mentally different. That's what I'm just going to call myself. But anyway, um, so long story short, you know, like, I got money now. Only, uh, I don't have money because I can't just, like, go to the bank and write myself a check for a million dollars and have a wild weekend down in Vegas. Uh, but like, it's all good, because Pastor Brown, he's a good dude. And uh, he'll, he'll take care of my finances. Oh, you never should have trusted him, Steve. He's, I, I just, I don't, I don't, you know, I know he seems like a nice guy, but I just don't want anybody having their grubby hands on my, I mean, your, 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 your money, uh, I, we, we just want to help you figure out how to have the most fun with your money. We don't need other people making decisions for you, because they're just gonna come up with some stupid plan about how you need to go back to school and get an education, or some cockamamie whatever. Uh, well, you know, nonsense, it's, it's all good. It's like, I don't know what I'm going to do. I just, I frankly am glad that I went to a new, better psych ward and I can just hang out there and, like, see what's what, check the comics out. Uh, right now, the website is cons and nines mag dot wordpress dot com we're working on it all the time you can go to conscience and nonsense dot com and then just click magazine you wind up in the right place Nate's pretty good he's pretty good he's learning wordpress and he's learning how to keep up with this whole uh web presence thing um 
we're all going to be rich and famous one day. Well, I'm rich already, uh, but uh, I'm not real. But we're all going to be famous one day. Um, it, would be neat. it would be neat if the money was real, wouldn't it, Nate? That'd be cool, wouldn't it? Yeah, I'm working on that. Uh, I don't want to... I don't want people to be fooled into thinking that I'm rich just because my cartoon character, uh, and I, I mean no disrespect when I call you that, Steve. Oh, no, no, no offense, I'm not taking that. It's all good. Yeah, I, I don't want people thinking that I'm independently wealthy because I created a cartoon character who has money because his uncle died and he inherited a bunch of money uh but like back when i was first doing the cartoon not back in the 90s but back when i first revived it back in um 2015 i was publishing it on instagram every day uh a lot of the time i do like a whole week's worth in a front in a row Monday through Friday, and then Saturday, and then take Sunday off, and, um, people would, like, Steve would be depressed, he'd be on the psych ward, he'd be depressed back in 2015, and, uh, people would say, or 16, whatever, you know, people would say, Nate, Nate, are you okay, I read your comic, and I'm like, you know, do people think it's a cry for help? Oh, yeah, I know. It's like everything is a cry for help when you're like us. You know, you're, you're mentally diagnosed. We're mentally diagnosed. We don't like the term mentally ill. We're, we have mental health issues, and we're mentally diagnosed, and we're differently abled. And everybody's, like, always worried about us, like... We're gonna go buy a bunch of fireworks and set them off near a paint thinner factory or some crazy, you know. A lot of people don't like the C word either. I don't mind, you know. I do, I do do stuff that's crazy sometimes. I do like walking in the rain, you know. I mean, how did that wind up happening? Just like I don't even know. I mean. <laughs> You would think I could leave Wildview and walk across the street. But yeah, they told me to leave the property. And you just walk across the street. I'm not on your property. You know, I could be on the other side of the street just making faces and obscene hand gestures and jumping up and down. And uh, what are they going to do? Call the cops on me? Be like, oh, we just kicked this guy out of here. He's across the street making faces. Come arrest him. What are you going to do, Baker Act and put him right back in here? What, I mean, you know, weird. Anyway, uh, but like, uh, do check out Comic Strip. Obviously, we got the podcast, trying to do it once a week now. Yeah, um, really hope to be keeping up with that. Um, might, might cut it short today. You know, we've been going, we've been going 16, 17 minutes, which is good and productive, but sometimes the podcast gets a little, uh, long-winded, I think. Yeah, you don't want to get long-winded, Nate. Has everyone forgotten about me? Do I get to have a word in edgewise? Go ahead, Professor. I, I just, I just want to say that I believe that I like the direction the comic strip is going, and, you know, if, if anyone wants to comment... Or email us at consandnons at gmail.com. C-O-N-S-A-N-D-N-O-N-S. Consandnons.com. Um, at gmail.com. Whatever, whatever. I'm all flabbergasted. But anyway, if you want to reach out, email us at consandnons at gmail.com to get it right got to be precise about these things. Don't want to cause confusion. Let us know about the direction you think the comic strip is going. We're on Twitter, we're on Instagram and TikTok. It, we've got a Facebook page. It's all cons and nons, which is short for conscience and nonsense. Just in case you weren't able to figure that out, not insulting your intelligence. 
just want you to know, trying to be perfectly clear, because it's very important to be perfectly clear, because, you know, confusion can be a difficult issue for us to um, deal with. Uh, but I, I think I've been talking too long, which wasn't actually that long, but uh, I don't know, I just um, have a little anxiety. Oh, back at, someone rescue me, back over to Nate. Yeah, well, uh, anyway, um, that, that's gonna do it for now. Uh, I just, thanks for tuning in, and, um, we're gonna see you out there at, uh, conscienceandnonsense.com. Still working on getting the website squared away and figured out. It's gonna always be a work in progress, but right now we're on the web at conscienceandnonsense.com. Just click magazine. That'll take you to the magazine. Lots of cool new stuff coming down the pike in the days, weeks, months, and years ahead. And um, go to consandnonsmag.wordpress.com. That'll take you right there. Whole cool magazine online articles. Just put up an article about the Will Smith Chris Rock fiasco. Um... Um, 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 I gotta go to, I gotta go to that, uh, what's the Toastmasters? They'll teach me how to stop saying, um, <laughs> that's all the time we have for today, folks. All right, say goodbye, guys. Goodbye. Cheerio. Later. See you guys. Have a good one. Stay cool.